<laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to the Hundo P Games Hype Hideout. Today we are taking a look at something I've been looking forward to for a very long time. I've backed it on Kickstarter, I have the collector's edition coming. It's going to be an awesome game. We're looking at the latest ukulele trailer. This is the E3 2016 trailer, and I am so, so excited for this game. I think it's going to be great. I haven't really seen too much gameplay yet, uh, except for the little kind of beta stuff, uh, prototype alpha work that they've shown off. Man, this game looks awesome. Awesome, the characters just look so good. I'm so excited. Okay, so we're gonna take a look at the trailer right now. I've been waiting for this all day. Oh yeah, Platonic. Whoa, wow. It's already a world of difference. Oh my god, the music. Grand Kirkle! Oh! David Wise! Oh. David Wise, Grand Kirkle! Oh my god! Wow! What is that? Oh my god! Magic Kazooie's back! back <laughs> the amount of work they've done oh, oh my god Possible noise, sound effect, music style, characters. The worlds look awesome. They look a lot more um, uh, Mario Galaxy uh, platforming type of worlds now. Banjo Kazooie had these more kind of open worlds almost, where you kind of went from section to section, finding different mini games, like when you meet Congo and you do the orange stuff, and then uh, you whatever it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, this looks a lot more platformy. Um, looks fantastic, though. Like, I need to see more. I need to see more. That 8-bit level, uh, or, or the, like the retro level with the uh, kind of pixelated dinosaur character, looks awesome. Uh, you know what? We're watching it again. <laughs> I need to. I need to see it again. Pop. I I really I need to take it all in. I need to take it all in. So it's already like rare logo spinning. The characters are great. Wow, you can see so the the view distance, but the draw distance is actually so nice. Okay, this is what I want to see: the minecart. So there's kind of 2D-ish or 2.5D sort of sections, kind of like what Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze did, uh, which was great. Honeycombs. It looks awesome. There's arcade machines in the back. It's so cool. So there's an invisibility power. That's similar to Banjo Kazooie shooting out the jewels in the eye. It reminds me of almost the uh, the first-person shooter uh, mode in Banjo Tooie, and I remember there's like a rotating statue, and you have to shoot uh, his eyes, I think, in his mouth or something. 
Yeah, okay. I'm, I, I'm so glad I backed this game. I'm so glad. If you guys are looking forward to this game, this is amazing. This is a reference to the end of the first Banjo-Kazooie game when they're lying on the beach and the woman comes up with the freaking watermelons in front of her chest because Rare was a bunch of dirty perverts. <laughs> um, wow. Wow! It's blowing my mind. I'm not going to be able to stop thinking about this game for until I... You know what? I don't know. I just can't deal with it. I just can't deal with it. Okay, if you guys liked the video, please, please, please let me know what you thought of ukulele in the comment section down below. Uh, I would love to have a discussion with you guys about this game. Let me know what you think. I think it looks mind-blowing. It's everything I have wanted from a new Banjo-Kazooie. Go away, nuts and bolts. Just go away. Thank you for watching the videos, and I will see you guys on the next Hundo P Games Hype Hideout. Hey everybody, thank you so much for checking out this video. If you liked the video, hit the like button, leave a comment down below. I would love to talk to you all about ukulele and how awesome it is. The Hype Hideout, just so you know, isn't the only show on this channel. If you're interested, go check out my 100p Games Double Third playthrough. There will still be more videos for that playthrough coming. Uh, it's a lot of editing work, but it is happening. Hype Hideout is a way for me to communicate with you guys in the meantime. So new content is always coming out on the channel. If you want to stay up to date, make sure you subscribe.